important milestone for HMLA 267 and it was our last flight of a whiskey Cobra. So uh, 25 years of flying whiskeys. We got our first one in 1987. Uh, so 25 years later, we're finally uh, out of the whiskey business. Uh, whiskey was a big part of uh, HMLA history. Uh, it saw action in uh, Iraq, Afghanistan, and uh, now we're uh, moving on to a bigger and better aircraft. I am really sad to see the whiskey go. Uh, it's got the coolest sounding rotor blades on earth, and I'll miss that, but uh, time goes on. For me, this is the end of an era, and that probably the last time I'm going to fly a whiskey. Um, for the rest of the pilots in the squadron, the younger guys, uh, the majority of them are, are right now in the process of converting over to the Zulu. Yeah, that whiskey platform has been, uh, it's been going strong here, obviously, for 25 years and it's still in service overseas. Uh, still, uh, still actively engaged in the fight in the OEF, still doing great things. It's bittersweet, you know, it's the, it, you know, we watched the, uh, the whiskey fly away. Uh, it's not the last flight for the whiskey, it's just the last flight for the whiskey here. But uh, somebody has to be first and, uh, you know, we're, we're embracing that. We, uh, the whiskey flies away today. Uh, it was our last one, so the beginning of a, uh, beginning of a new era, pretty easy uh, mark, mark on the tape of time. I mean, a, a great helicopter that's had a great history in the Marine Corps. I think uh, when the guys on the ground see a whiskey coming overhead, um, you know, they know they're going to get some very good support. And, uh, you know, I think uh, the whiskey has just been a success story for, you know, for 25 plus years. <laughs>